Hi, this is Eric from Pure Beauty Fitness. Uh, I'm going to start another new body part series. A lot of times we have certain body parts that maybe we're not happy with and we might do a strategy for a while and see some changes but then we plateau. We always preach, change things up frequently. So I'm going to start working from the bottom up and uh, do a new routine every week, give you a new kind of shake them up routine for different body parts. Kind of coming from my bodybuilding past, um, you know, and I know we're all probably our own worst critics. So it gives you some different things that you can do to really kind of go after body parts. And I'm going to start with calves. Um, some people are born with great calves. Um, it just seems like one of those body parts that's really stubborn if you don't have great calves. Um, you know, if there's not a lot of shape to them or not a lot of, you know, muscularity to them. And you want to improve them. Um, you know, frankly, you got to get taken the term from Pulp Fiction. you got to get medieval on them. And uh, I was never blessed with great calves, so I had to work really hard to bring my calves up. And I still do. And so one of the routines I found recently that I really saw some great results from was this, uh, this routine. It's an old school routine, and it, it's just a brutal calf routine. So I'm going to share it to you, share, share it with you today. But what I noticed by doing this routine, I noticed a big change in my calves. Probably one of the best routines I've ever done. So what you need is you need a weighted standing calf machine. So if you have a gym, you, can use, you could use a leg press, but a standing Smith machine. Um, we're going to use our free motion machine today, and I'm just going to walk you through this, this routine. So it's pretty short. Uh, with me camera person can you see me mm -hmm. yep right. so you're gonna you're not gonna need a lot of weight for this and here's our makeshift standing calf so you're gonna start out with your calf machine whatever calf machine you're using and you're gonna make sure that you you sink down on the bottom pause for a second stretch the hand for the calves come up hold down stretch up hold down stretch up hold. You're going to complete 15 reps, real slow tempo, controlled fashion. When you get done, you're going to shake your feet out each side twice. Then you're going to reposition. You're going to come down and up again for eight reps. And then once again, you're going to do a quick shake out, only one time on each side this time. Then the next one, you're going to repeat that again. I'm going to do eight reps again. And now when I get to number eight, what I'm going to do is I'm going to explode fast, explosive pumper reps. And I'm going to go until I can't do another rep. There's no number here. You're going to get a good burn going. You're going to go until they're burning until you can't complete another full rep. Once you're done and those calves are on fire, you shake them out once again. Then once you're done shaking them out, you're going to take and do some negatives. You're going to just come up with a double calf raise, and you're going to lower real slow, take about six seconds minimum, and you're going to come up. Notice how I'm pushing myself up, and I'm lowering down from one calf. And I'm going to do ten of these on each side. And then I'm going to rest. I'm going to rest about two to three minutes, stretch my calves out, and I'm going to repeat that. After doing that for two weeks, what you're going to do is you're going to add, uh, on the second set of eight, you're going to add another set of pumpers, and you're going to increase those negatives at the end from 10 all the way up to if you can get to 20. So try to increase those every time. You'll see it written down here in the description. But this is a great calf routine. I would do it every other day, three days a week. Um, a, a medieval calf routine to get those calves to respond, to get them to shape up, to really round out your leg development. So. There you are for the week, our medieval calf routine. That's our body part of the week. Come back next week, we'll do some hamstring and glute work. See you next week.